hi and welcome to another video of Yocto tutorial series in this video we are going to learn about BBA pen file so in this video we are going to cover the following topics what is original or base recipe what is BBA pen file why BBA, BBA pen files are, you, are needed where to place BBA pen file and we will see all of this with a simple example so in Yocto project, a BBA pen file is used to extend or modify the behavior of a existing recipe without actually modifying the original recipe. So this allows you to make changes to a recipe without directly editing the source code, which is important for maintaining the modularity and ease of each updates in a code or Yocto based build system. So what does it mean? Now let us see this with a diagram so let us say this is my build system and build the system I have two recipe uh, I have two layers as you know in our build system we have layers which is uh, prefix with this meta keyword so we have meta example and we have meta custom let us say that this meta example keyword uh, this meta example uh, layer is a third party layer we, we haven't uh, created this so this is a third party layer and inside this meta example we have a recipe folder called recipes example and inside this recipes example we have a example dot bb so this example dot bb we will call it original recipe or base recipe so now what is a bb append file so a bb append file let us say i want to make changes in this uh, uh, in some changes in this recipe but this as we know that this is from a third party and we do not want to touch this recipe otherwise we will lose the modularity or later on we will not we will uh, we, we will not know or the if uh, some other person is using this he will not know that what changes we made in this original source or original bp file for that yocto provides a mechanism to edit these uh, original or base recipes for that we need a custom recipe uh, we need a bb append file of that recipe so for bb append file uh, what we normally do is we create our own custom layer and inside those custom layer inside that custom layer we will have a recipe folder and inside that recipe folder we will have this example dot bb append so the syntax here is that the name of the bb append file should be same as the original or base recipe for example here we have example.bb here we will have example.bb append otherwise the system will not know that which that which bb append file corresponds to which original recipe and it can be inside any recipe folder it is not uh, necessary to have inside the recipe example so we, here we also should have recipe example this is not required but the name of the recipe and bp print file should be the same one more thing is we can also make a bb append file inside the same uh, meta layer given from the third party or from pokey or from anywhere else but i would not recommend to do that because in this way we will make we will may, we may lose the modularity of this layer that's why i will create a new layer and then i will create a bb append file so here we put the bb append file so here i have an example in local.conf i have bb example recipe that i have included so now this bb example recipe is here i am not using two uh, meta layers because both uh, because i have created the example and both are uh, both example are created by me so that's why i am not using this uh, one more uh, other layer but in the real world example we will be creating an extra layer for example we have a meta pocky provided by third uh, party and here is for example this uh, bb uh, bb file so for this bb file we will not make changes inside this bb file for that maybe we can create a recipe folder here and inside that we will create tiny dot bb append and this is how we can change but for here in example we see how do we do that so I have a BB example, BBB example recipe. So here we are doing something with this recipe. So first of all, this is an old example. You can uh, 
check my previous uh, very initial videos uh, to uh, for C program video uh, if you want to learn more about this recipe and also uh, you can check my build tasks uh, re videos uh, if you want to learn more about the details of this recipe so but here we are echoing this uh, configuration and the configuration is step to the bb example dot h first of all let us build this and check and see uh, what binary and what output do we get so here right now i am building the full command line because in local.conf i have added this so i am adding full command line right now so as you can see that uh, build has been completed successfully now let me connect this uh, to the beagle bone black and we will check the output of this bb example binary so uh, as you can see that i have connected to the beagle bone black terminal and now let us run the binary it is pbb example and press enter so here you see the two outputs the welcome to Yocto tutorial and hello there I am an example code so if you look at our BB file so here we have defined the two configuration that I want a welcome message and I want a hello message so there is also a third message if we look at the C file in the source so if you if you look at the source so there is a welcome for the welcome there is a hello world hello world message for the hello and there is also a third one goodbye that we are not getting right now so for that what we can do is i can add here this goodbye in pb file this pb recipe but as i said that this is not the recommended way or this is not the how it, how it should work so for that what i did is in my meta layers in the same uh, here bbb example i have a in in recipe examples i have a bbb example and i also created a bbb example append to append this and here in the bbb example append i did do configure which is our this step here and i did an append so what does it mean append mean that i want to i want to extend this do configure function so in do configure function i did echo define goodbye and also send it to bbb example dot h it means that here without touching this original recipe or base recipe we extended the functionality of this bbb example and let me just unmask this because i have masked this uh, so that it does not take uh, into consideration from the build system now the build system can see this uh, please uh, watch my previous video if you don't know how BB masks work and now build it once again so I am again building bitbake core image full command line and this configuration changes should take into effect in the binary and we should see one more message like goodbye please come here again so the recipe has been built successfully now let us test this also so to test this uh, changes or recipe let us run again pbb example now as you can see that this time we also have this third message goodbye please come here again so how did we get this message because we add the new configuration to this header file using this bb append file so this is how we can use bb append file so in summary bb append file is used to do the modifications in the original or the base recipe what kind of modifications we can do we can do adding or changing build options adding dependencies or modifying existing ones patching the source code for adding or modifying environment variables and adding post install installation scripts so this is all about bb append file so in the next video i will i will uh, i will be discussing a very important uh, variable yocto variable which is related to this bb file so 
bb apparent file not bb file bb apparent file so hope you like this video please like and subscribe my channel and i will see you in the next video thanks for watching